The Fiji government has assured international investors that their investment in Nigeria businesses will be profitable. The Minister of Trade and Investment, Okechuku and Nelame, gave this assurance in Abuja, the Direct Investor Summit Nigeria 2018. Kikelo Mokera was there. The Minister of Industry, Trade and Investment points out that one of the major priorities of the Nigerian government has been creation of an enabling business environment in which property rights governed by the rule of law. He further maintained that the federal government is committed to markets that take the lead while government efficiently fulfill its role as protector and enabler. The minister says the summit is expected to connect key stakeholders to discuss issues and stimulate meaningful exchange of investment ideas. Through your engagement with the federal government at this summit, you know, and at other similar fora, I hope that we're going to see these things begin to be converted. We just finished the focus labs for ERGP. The whole idea is to engage and turn these announcements into real investment. And a key part of that, which is a vision why this summit is holding, is because we believe that we can be one of the most attractive countries for investors and investments. You know, I like when you turn problems into opportunities. Statistician General of the Federation, Yemi Kale, encouraged potential investors to partner with Nigeria as the fundamental that makes the country a good investment destination remains intact. Various reforms are being implemented to ensure the economy continues on a more sustainable path following the recovery. These reforms are aimed at improving the business environment, simplifying tax administration, facilitating a one-stop investment destination and improving port operations. In a presentation, financial expert Bismarck Rewani urged Nigeria not to relax after existing recession, noting that a sustainable game-changing formula is not only imperative but inevitable for the country. Our focus is for a mixed outcome based on political expediency and economic necessity and reality. This hybrid of the same state and game changing scenario will lead to a GDP of above $600 billion from the current $400 billion. That is to achieve 6 to 8% growth rate by 2022 and 4 to 5% growth rate by 2020. The summit brings together domestic and foreign direct investors to create and increase awareness on the existing investment opportunity in Nigeria. The summit focus on agriculture, transport, manufacturing, power and gas, as well as information and communication technology. Kike Lomo Okiri, Core TV News, Abuja.